To continue with the conditional expressions, and we are going to take a new example about finding the minimum and the maximum between the two numbers. So, if I have two numbers, x and y, and I need to get the minimum, so val minimum of type integer, and if a less than b, then minimum equal x, sorry, x less than y, so minimum equal to x. Otherwise, I would put else and put the minimum, minimum y equal to, a uh, minimum equal to y, okay? This is very simple. I will create a val max of type int if x greater than y then max equal to x else max equal to y okay I am finding the minimum and the maxim maximum between the two numbers. By now, you know how this works, but it's a lot of code. Okay, let's take a look at how we can improve this using the fact that if else expression returns a value. As I told you, we we said that they are conditional expressions and they are not conditional statements because expressions return a value and this value this returning value we are going to um, use it making use of conditional of returning value of expressions How to make use of them despite writing all of these codes to find the minimum and the maximum I can, uh, and assign them to min and max uh, variables. I can put like this. So I have created above the variable x and y and I will change the code val minimum and val maximum into uh, simple lines. So val minimum equal to if a or x less than y then put it uh, as x assign it to x otherwise assign it to y it's very simple guys it goes and minimum because i have created minimum here Despite writing all of these codes, if x less than y put m a minimum equal, I write it with a one line. Val minimum equal to. This is the expression. It returns the expression. So this will return expression. So if x less than y, it return x. Otherwise, it will return y. So minimum equal to x if x less than y. And minimum equal to y when it is x greater than y. So the returning value of the expression of this, if x less than y, it returns x. This is the uh, this is the difference between the expression and the statement. Other, in other languages like Java and Python and other things, they it were it not return the uh, the value of the expression. So we have learned how to make the minimum. Now let's create the val of maximum equal to if x greater than y, it will return x, else return y. Okay. In the first example, the condition uh, is a x less than b 
or x less than y if it is this true the result assigning assigned back to the minimum will be the value of x if it is false the the result will be the value of y so minimum is set to if we go up 7 less than 5 so minimum is set to 7 and maximum in the same way would be set it to the 50 okay in this way we have learned how to make uh, a very simple and, and uh, make very simple uh, coding and despite writing all of this code we make use of returning value of expression and we have used it in one line to detect the minimum and the maximum okay it's very simple and uh, i hope you benefit from this video uh, and uh, this course please rate us five stars on udemy uh, to support us making new videos